All right, I'm gonna show you how to find the energy of a Cheeto using this lab data. The first thing to note is I have 50 milliliters of water that I'm gonna use, and I know that there is one milliliter for every one gram of water. So when I use this first formula, Q equals M, my M is actually going to be 50 grams of water. And I got that because I was using 50 milliliters of water. For my C in this formula, I'm going to use the specific heat of water. The specific heat of water is always 4.184. And the units is joules slash grams degrees Celsius. So I'm going to go ahead and write that in my problem. And then my delta T in my problem, I use this formula right here. TF stands for temperature final, which is this, 23 0.1 degrees Celsius and my temperature initial or my starting temperature was 18.5 degrees Celsius. You want to show all work and always label every unit. The difference here is 4.6. So I'm going to plug that in. Then I'm going to use my calculator. The units cancel out Celsius with Celsius, grams with grams. I'm going to be left with joules. Okay, so I have found out the joules of energy in my Cheeto. Now the question is, well, how much, how much energy really is there? And so I have to take into account how, much, how many grams of my Cheeto actually burned. So I'm going to do my initial mass of my Cheeto subtracted from my final mass of my Cheeto. And this will give me how many grams I actually burned. And finally, for part C, I'm going to use the two values and divide them. And this will give me the information I want, which is the content of the Cheeto per gram of Cheeto burned, or also known as joules per gram. So I'm going to take my value from part A, 962.32 joules. I'm going to divide it by my answer in B, which was 1.75 grams. My units do not cancel out, and I am left with 549.90. We round a little bit there at the end. You always want two numbers after the decimal point, and the unit is joules per gram. Now I can use this value and compare it to other food products and decide which one has more energy per gram.